Ha! Ah. <laughs> messing with you. I knew it was recording. Hey, what's up? And thanks for tuning in. I'm Anubis, the Gothic Tech Guy, and we have tech news for you. Sorry, got distracted. I'm using my Jet Black iPhone 7 Plus that you should have seen the unboxing on my video, past video. And as it's recording me, I'm seeing my reflection in the back of it because it's so beautifully gloss and yes I'm using the back camera because my house don't have bright light I'm gothic it's damn man damn okay so the, let's start off with the note 8 the note 8 is official it is definitely coming out uh, there's no release date as of this video um, but it's due to come out within like three or four months it's gonna have eight gigs of RAM they're gonna up the processor. Um, storage, I believe, is gonna be the same. And uh, the design is gonna be a little more enhanced. You know, so pretty much everything we wanted for them to do in the first place, they're gonna do it now. Um, because of all the problems with it exploding in people's pockets, um, they're looking at other people to help make it. So they're looking at LG, for instance, to make the battery and stuff like that. Which is cool and all, but they haven't really come clean of what exactly went wrong with it, why it started exploding, because I think it's more than just the battery, if you think about it. Um, the first problem was if you plug it in with a bootleg cable, or in fact any cable that it didn't came with, it could cause it to explode. Okay, well, so they took it offline and we did it over and bring it out. Now it's overheating in people's pockets and blowing up and blowing up, blowing out people's ass cheeks. That's not good. So yeah, it just got worse. So it can't just be the battery. It's something inside. Some wires are being angled, whatever. Yeah. All right. So, and speaking of the note, note seven, um, there are people still out there using it, and you probably watching my video on your note. And if you are, hmm. I seen you, and you know, because I live in the city, so I see them with their coral blue Note Seven, taking pictures and doing whatever they do with their phone. And I'm just like, wow, you know, why you didn't? Why haven't you turned your phone in, like, dude, or do that? Like, come on. And I know you like. Well, maybe your phone don't doesn't get hot. You don't see no danger. Hey, I feel you. My phone didn't overheat either. I mean, it got pretty hot when I had multiple things going. Like, let's say I'm uploading a, a video to my YouTube channel. And at the same time on Facebook or texting someone. You know, if I'm multitasking. Let's just put it that way. I noticed that uh, it got pretty hot in the back. And it made me look at it like, uh, you're not going to... Okay, you good? All right, you good, you good. So, you know, it never blew up on me, even though it got a little hot when I was doing a lot of things on it. But I still turned it in because it's that, that, that little chance, you know? Like, I have a beautiful wife, beautiful cat, nice house. Don't need things to go on blaze while I'm sleeping in my coffin, you know? Um, So, for this... For you people who's out there who still have your Note 7, they, Samsung's encouraging you to know, turn it into your provider and get a S7 or S7 Edge, and you will get like fifty dollars off if you also also you get fifty dollars off if you don't want to use those phones uh, and get like something else. You get like a discount, like you know, like I switched to the iPhone, um, so if you switch something else, you get a discount. I mean, they offer a lot of deals because they want you to bring your phone in, um, which is it's good, but you have to bring your phone in. I think you should. Um, also, if you do switch to an S7 or S7 Edge, what they're going to do is when a Note 8 come out, it will be out in three, uh, three months or four months they're trying to shoot for, but they're trying to make sure everything is safe and stuff. So when it do come out, you better switch to the Note 8 no questions asked, I believe. You just even swap, bop, 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 and you're good to go. So, 
yeah. <clears throat> um, and if you're looking at my T-Mobile show, you're like, oh, you works with T-Mobile. No, no, don't work with T-Mobile. Uh, I have T-Mobile service, and what T-Mobile is doing is they have the free Tuesdays, free Tuesday, Tuesday free, Tuesday deal, Tuesday, something Tuesday. It's Tuesday. I'm pretty sure it's Tuesday. All right, so every Tuesday you get something free, and uh, like a frosty shake. Uh, I think one time I got cookies at uh, Subway or whatever. But the coolest thing is I got free tickets to see the Suicide Squad and the Steam Mobile shirt. What? What? <laughs> so yeah, decided to use it for my video tutorials because I mean. I'm not going to wear it on a date or anything. I mean, Got to put it to use for something, you know. I don't know. And plus, T-Mobile is doing really good to me. So, eh, why not? Uh, let's see. So, we cover that. We cover that. And, uh, hey, Halloween is coming. And I want to do something special on my channel for Halloween. Being a goth vamp and all. So, look for that. I, I, I'll... Put something that works, uh, something nice, something cool, something scary, something fun. Yeah, definitely. Um, and hey, I noticed my numbers on my channels is going down. Not complaining, but complaining. I'm saying it's Halloween. I'm the gothic tech guy. I should be on everyone's phone. Share my video, and for you loyal subscribers that stayed with me, I know my videos and stuff yo always thumbs up i definitely appreciate it um tell a friend tell a friend tell a friend have a friend tell a friend post me on facebook why not i mean they see my face they're definitely gonna click on a video on your facebook because what black gothic guy whoa <laughs> I only say that because when me and my wife is out, we get stopped all the time. Oh my God, I can't believe your style. Oh, can I take pictures of you? Yeah, apparently there's a whole Tumblr thing dedicated to me and my wife. It's crazy. We would just be chilling and there's pictures of us walking by, pictures of us looking at each other. Like we're not even posing for the pictures and we're getting sniped. Ha, ha, ha. Honestly, I didn't mind at first until I realized, wait, they're making money off taking pictures of us. Whoa, that's crazy talk because we're not getting any cut of that. I'm just saying. So, hey, I have a YouTube channel. I have uh, uh, um, Instagram, Facebook. I mean, you want a picture of us or see me, you could see me without sniping me because, geez, that's really annoying, you know? Right. All right, so... I know I'm, I I get lost and ramble on other things, but you know, let's see. So we covered the Note 8. We covered the return policy of the Note 8. Oh, what we didn't cover is the pistol. Look at that. I was about to hang up the phone. All right. So the owner of T-Mobile is pushing people to get, you know, that want the pistol anyway, to get the unlocked pixel phone and bring it to T-Mobile and use it with T-Mobile service. And they he even showed that it's working good. He has a Pixel phone. It's working great with his service. Um, and even on their YouTube channel, T-Mobile YouTube channel, for those who, who didn't know YouTube, um, yeah, uh, T-Mobile has a YouTube channel. So, yeah, uh, <laughs> that happened. And uh, on their channel, they have an unboxing of the uh, Pixel. They actually do a lot of fun unboxing of different phones and stuff. I, I think it's really cool the, the way they're going about doing it, you know. Um, so yeah, that happened. <laughs> so apparently if you like the Pixel phone, I did a review of it on my channel. In fact, it should be the video I just uploaded before this one. Uh, it's a decent phone. I love the screen. I love the operating system. I'm not a fan of the design per se, but you know, it works really good. I mean, yeah, you know, I think my opinion, that's the best Android phone out right now. Definitely. Um, and if I was to switch from Apple to Android as a main phone, because I, I use the Android phone, I have 
just crap in that I didn't do a review of at all. The uh, cool pad. It's not a big name or anything. It's just a phone that I use for my work. I use my iPhone for personal stuff. I mean, it does. It is for work too because I shoot my videos on it and upload it. But as far as business calls, yeah, I would rather be on a different phone altogether. Like, you know, this way when I don't want to do business, I can just turn it off and don't be bothered with it. You know, I don't know what's going on with my hands. I don't know why they're moving. Don't ask me. All right, so uh, I'm gonna go drink. Did I say that? You know, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go do things. But thanks for tuning into my video. And like I said, share it, comment, rate, subscribe. And uh, peace. Because we covered everything. Yeah, peace.